your WLKY weather with meteorologist Chris Johnson. All right, let's take it back in time just a little bit. Last year's September sizzle, I certainly know that Vicki remembered this heat because we were talking high temperatures in the upper 90s this time last year. My goodness, and that went on to be the hottest temperature of 2019. Crazy. And if you remember a little bit further out, say getting into the first of October, we had upper 90s for the first couple of days of October. By Halloween, we were spitting snow. Crazy. Also, with September and the heat that we had last year, went on to have 22 90 degree days, and six of those 22 were in the upper 90s. Folks, that is some heat. But don't get me wrong, it was still pretty warm out there today, officially topping out in the lower 90s under a mix of sun and clouds. And look at that, down just two from that official high. Dew points a little higher, though. You can certainly feel the difference out there. It's warm and a little bit more muggy. Temperature-wise, in a lot of locations, mid to upper 80s from top to bottom. And as we head throughout this evening, folks, once again, it's dry, so good news there, but on the warmer side. So if you have any evening plans, things look great. Just a little warm out there. Believe it or not, I had a cold front push across the area. Now continues to dive south and east, and it did bring a stray sprinkle or shower, especially to our far south and east. Most of us stay dry, though. What this cold front will do is deliver some seasonable temperatures as we get into your Friday. As far as this evening is concerned, looks good out there. Just warm. We'll see some clouds stick around. Temperatures dropping from the upper 80s, falling into the upper 70s by late evening, getting into tonight, eventually cooling off into the 60s to right around 70 degrees in many spots. Future cast heading throughout tonight into your Friday, keeping a few of the clouds around. A mix of sun and clouds expected for your Friday afternoon. But hey, things looking good temperature wise. We're topping out in the middle 80s, low and mid 80s for those afternoon highs. Just a great looking weather day in store as we wrap up the work week. Look at this high school football kicking off for your Friday night. It looks fantastic, folks. Lower 80s for kickoff, falling into the mid to upper 70s for the ride home. Just a few clouds out there and hey, no rain, but enjoy it while you can because yes, those rain chances will return to the forecast just in time for the weekend. I know, I know we've had this great stretch of weather. Now the rain chances return all because of that powerful system that was spinning out west across the four corners. Big time temperature drop, snow for us, none of that, but it will bring some scattered showers and storms starting Saturday afternoon continues into the first part of your Sunday. I believe by Sunday afternoon, late afternoon, best rain chances will be east and southeast. We kick that cold front out of here and we start to cool things off, turning less humid into early next week. All right, forecast for this evening, partly cloudy. We're dry and warm once again, falling from the 80s into the upper 70s. We look ahead for tomorrow to calm start, a little bit warmer, 70, but we're only climbing into the mid 80s for those afternoon highs. It's a seasonable weather day across much of the area. All right, here's a look at that seven day forecast. Rain chances returning for your Saturday into Saturday night, wrapping up as we get into the first part of your Sunday. And then look what happens Monday, Tuesday. We're drying skies out cooler, lower humidity. Rick, Vicky, then we track in some more rain and storm chances next midweek. But let's forget about that. Let's yeah. focus in on the great looking weather <laughs> for Friday night football. It feels good to say that. And then early next week with those cooler temperatures. Yeah, it'd be, be nice, nice to have some dry skies on Friday night. Oh, it's going to be lovely, folks. Get out and enjoy it. All right. Thank you, Chris. Sure.